I'm Sarah Hashim Morris in the Los Angeles Times newsroom. More than a dozen current and former Los Angeles County Sheriff's deputies were arrested by the FBI or were expected to surrender to investigators as part of a two year long probe into alleged inmate abuse and misconduct inside county jails. The cases allegedly involve use of excessive force, obstruction of justice and improperly arresting and searching the jail's visitors, according to an indictment. The Times reports that at least three people, including a lieutenant, a sergeant and a a deputy were taken into the FBI's custody as part of a federal obstruction of justice probe into how sheriff's officials handled an FBI informant at the center of the jail investigation. The informant, Anthony Brown, told the Times that FBI agents regularly visited him in jail and he gave them names of abusive deputies. Brown said once his cover was blown, he was moved at the jail, had his name changed in the prison system, and was interrogated by deputies on whether he planned to testify in court. One of the indictments describes three separate incidents alleging the use of excessive force and unlawful visitor arrests. The Times reports that the indictment alleges that visitors were taken to a deputy break room, which couldn't be seen by the public, and beaten by sheriff's officials. One visitor even had his arm fractured. The U.S. Attorney's Office said today that criminal corruption and civil rights charges will be announced against members of the law enforcement agency. For more, visit LATimes.com and at LA Now on Twitter for the latest updates.